When will Princess Anne return to her royal work after hospital stay for concussion? Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Princess Anne has returned home from hospital after a five-night stay, but her return to royal duties remains unclear. King Charles' sister, 73, was admitted to Southmead Hospital in Bristol after an accident at her Gatcombe Park home on June 23. She suffered a concussion and minor injuries consistent with possible impact from the horse's head or legs, but the exact details of the accident cannot be confirmed due to her concussion. The Telegraph also reported that Princess Sam was suffering from memory loss due to the accident, although it is believed to be temporary. The Princess Royal is now continuing her recovery at home and receiving rehabilitation support. There is no set date for her return to public service, which will occur when her medical team recommends it is safe to do so. After the accident, Princess Sam had to finish her work schedule for the week. She missed the state banquet held at Buckingham Palace in honor of Japan's state visit to the United Kingdom on June 25 and was unable to travel to Canada for a planned visit. A Buckingham Palace spokesperson said on June 24, Her Royal Highness sends her apologies to anyone who may have felt upset or disappointed as a result. Her hospitalization and recovery means the hard-working member of the royal family is on the sidelines. Princess Anne is highly praised for her strong work ethic and often records the highest number of royal engagements in a single calendar year. She keeps at it, often carrying out multiple engagements in one day, Dickie Arbiter, Queen Elizabeth's former press secretary, told The Telegraph. In 2023, Queen Elizabeth's only daughter reportedly made 457 engagements, surpassing even King Charles' number of engagements. Arbiter explained, most of what the king does happens behind the scenes, in meetings and browsing through his red boxes, which does not require mention in the court circular. Princess Anne's accident is the latest in a series of health-related setbacks for the British royal family. Both King Charles and Kate Middleton started the year with some procedures, with the 75-year-old royal being treated for an enlarged prostate, while the Princess of Wales, 42, underwent abdominal surgery. Both later announced that they had been diagnosed with cancer and would postpone their public duties while undergoing treatment, marking the first time two senior royals had cancer simultaneously. Princess Anne went on to represent the monarchy alongside Queen Camilla, Prince William, Prince Edward, Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh and others. King Charles resumed public royal duty in late April, and the royal family was reunited for Trooping the Collar on June 15 when Princess Kate made her first public appearance in nearly six months. However, Palisades stressed that Kate's appearance does not mean a full return to royal duties. Any upcoming outings will depend on when she feels able and with the guidance of her medical team. Just before she was admitted to hospital, Princess Anne appeared at the Royal Ascot Horse Races on three consecutive days from June 18 to June 20. Thanks for watching, please don't forget to subscribe. See you in our next video.